Hi guys, how are you all doing? Um, before I start, I just want to say a massive, massive thank you to all of my amazing subscribers. Um, we topped 500 yesterday and to say I am thrilled is an understatement. I never thought in a million years my little colour on channel would get any followers, never mind 500. Um, I'm absolutely blown away. For once, I'm a bit dumbfounded for words. I've made some amazing friends on the channel already. Um, some really lovely, kind and very humorous people and I am absolutely thrilled. So thank you very much guys. When I looked this morning I think it was 504 of you on there. So big, big waves to all of you and thank you for your support and um, the love that you've poured out onto my channel. Um, both for me and for the other people who subscribe. I think you're all just amazing. Um, so yeah, thanks people. Um, I'm going to share a couple of finished pieces with you that I've done this week just to prove I haven't been completely idle. Um, the first one is this one which is for the Dandy Morphia hashtag um, which is being run by Dev and Sandy and this is the Dragon from Mythomorphia double page spread. It's done in new colours, prisoner colours and the gold bits are in Ganzai Tambi paint, gold paint. So that's my dragon. Um, took about four nights worth of colouring, drove me nuts. Um, I think it'll be a while before I do another Kirby Rosan double page spread, but you never know. Because, yeah, you'll see. <laughs> so that was that. And I also did, oops, gosh, I'm going to drop my board. Last night I did this, which I'll just zoom you in a little bit, people. There we are. That was nice and gentle, wasn't it? Um, this is the galleon on the back page of Drommenwanger or um, Zemna Snova, whichever book you have, whichever version you have. This is also done in Prisoner Colours and Silver um, Zebra Gel Pen because um, the back page is sparkly and shiny. Um, so yeah, I did that last night and um, yeah, I quite enjoyed doing that eventually when I decided that yeah let's tackle it because there are a couple more in this book that I kind of want to have a go at um, I've been saving the bolts for some reason hmm don't know where they are now there so yes maybe I've got a thing for the Mary Rose so these kind of remind me of that that's another piece I've done and this, which is completely in Limouche markers. This one was rescued because the dog came in and um, stuck his great big dirty paw right in the middle of it. So it needed a bit of a rescue. Um, so he's a bit darker than I anticipated. Um, he's got a little bit of sparkle on his bot just there can see and the little dragonfly thing has sparkly wings can you see the sparkle probably not because the light's rubbish but yeah um so that's my little rescued dragon um and like i say he's done in marker pen so that was another piece that was done on the 8th of this month and then this arrived! Whoa! 
this is the most bizarre book I've had to date. Um, I asked my mum to pick this up for me and she popped it in the mail. Um, and it was this cat on the front that I saw and this one which looks like Magic Cat. Um, so yeah, I'm going to do a flip through of this one because it's bizarre. <laughs> on every level. These pictures are gorgeous. Don't know how I'm going to colour them. These pictures are crazy. There's things like a cat in a casserole and a cat in a bun. Um, cat in a blender. We won't go there right now. And yeah, that's it. So just once again, guys, thank you very much for subscribing and um, Here's to the next 500, whoever you may be. <laughs> Speak to you all soon. Take care for now. Bye.